Dodgers are up one run in the top of the sixth inning, but the Phillies have a runner on second base. The tying run, no outs. This breakdown is brought to you by T-Mobile, America's largest 5G network. They're going to bunt them over to third base, put them in even closer scoring position. Nice play by the Dodgers to get the safe, safe, fielder obstruction, fielder obstruction. What? Huh? Don't even, don't even. Hunter Russell says, don't even. Russell says, what are you talking about? I'm running. I'm running to the bag. How could I obstruct? What? What? I know, but what? You asked. I'm telling you, all right? Yeah, but to say, I understand that. You asked me, and I'm telling you, all right? So there's new rules about this, and the rule is that the, the fielder can't plant himself in the sliding lane without the ball because guys were getting hurt. It was a thing third baseman would do when they dive back or on stolen bases. You would put your leg in between the base and you or your foot to block the runner's path. This is a bit different because he's not planted. So I don't know what the new rule specifically says, but this is what umpire Hunter Wendelstadt sees. This angle shows what he sees. He sees the, the foot of the, of the runner hit the foot of the fielder, which slows the path to the base. So that seems to be what he sees and what he's focusing on. Now, I don't know the wording of the new rule, but most obstruction rules say that once the fielder has the ball, he can somewhat do what he wants to to finish the play, you know, while in act of making the play. So he catches the ball there. If it went to replay, I think they see that, and this gets overturned. You you can't you can't go to replay on this. I never understand that. So they can't go to replay. So I think this is a botch call. But again, I'm not 100% familiar with the interpretation of the rule. You can go to Close Call Sports. They'll have a video up. Um, they do a great job over there. But I think this is a botched call. So does Miguel Rojas. So the Dodgers. So did both sets of announcers. But I understand why he's calling it because he's not able to look at the ball and glove and the two feet sliding at the same exact time. He can't see all of that when he's that close honed in on one thing. So he just sees the foot hit the foot and he doesn't know that he had the ball and that's illegal. So he says obstruction, obstruction right away. It's a really nice play. Third baseman comes in, bobbles it for a second, shortstops running over, grabs it. Makes the tag. Really nice play to stop the tying run. Now, Robert saw his player arguing with the umpire, and he comes out of the dugout. No. Hey. No. I get to defend my player. I'm defending my player. No. No, it's fine. Don't worry about it. I'm not arguing about that. Walk away. I know. Hold on. Walk away. Walk away. I'm turning. Uh, Don't follow me. Wendelstad treated Roberts like he was a wild animal that was following him on his hiking trail. He's like, no, 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 no. Don't worry about, back away, walk away, walk away. I'm turning, don't follow me. But Roberts kept walking with him. He told him not to, you're out of here. Roberts like, what are you talking about? I wasn't even arguing the play. I'm just, I'm just defending my player. I'm trying to, you're yelling at my player. I'm just, I'm not yelling at him. I'm explaining. I can defend my player. Defend him from what? From getting tossed. I wasn't going to toss him. And that's where Roberts gets really upset. See, because Dave, he's like, how do I know you're not going to toss him? I can't read your mind. All I know is what it looks like. It looks like you're arguing. And I'm just trying to come out and cool the waters. I wasn't even arguing about the call, even though I don't think it's right. And that's the hand on the hips. That's disappointed. He was mad earlier, right? And now this hand on hips, deep sigh, deep breath, that's disappointment. Looking off into space. That's disappointment. And the umpire's like, he's frustrated. He's arguing about the rule. I was just trying to protect him. I turned my back to you and said, don't follow me. And then you followed me. Well, Roberts is like, well, okay. So he got ejected. They didn't like the call at all. Wendelstadt, he liked the call. He agreed with it. Maybe he didn't when he went back and watched it. I have no idea. What do you think? Right call? Wrong call? Good rule? Bad rule? One thing to keep in mind. Whether you're home or away, experience better game days with T-Mobile, America's largest 5G network. To learn more, visit tmobile.com slash MLB. Thanks for watching and tuning in. And thanks to Hunter Wendelstad. He's given us some good ones this year. He's given us some good ones. Remember when he threw out that fan for no 
that memory throughout that fan. Uh, <laughs> throughout Boone, thinking it was a fan. That was good stuff. <laughs>